I was born in New Orleans and grew up on the west bank of Mississippi in a town called Marrero. I um, grew up on the bayou and uh, moved to Connecticut when I was 11 years old. Graduated, went to college in Washington, D.C. at George Washington and studied classical voice and then moved back to New Orleans in 2003. So, born and raised on the bayou, still Cajun at heart. Paradise, <laughs> it's beautiful. The mountains and the water and oh, the people and the music and everything, the food, the cheese, the chocolate, the pizza, everything is outstanding. It's, um, it's, it's just a beautiful country, a beautiful city. It's going to be very difficult to go back to New Orleans. And during your performance, mm -hmm. we saw you singing, we saw you also playing the trumpet at the jam sessions. Trombone. At the Badly. trombone. Si. And we also know that you are a dancer. Si. And how will you judge the dancing performance of the <laughs> Creole Sweet Peas show? Well, the style of dancing I do is very different. I do swing and Lindy Hop in Charleston. What they do is burlesque, um, which is the art and the dance of strip teasing. So what, what we brought to Ascona is a very beautiful and, and elegantly put show um, where the girls demonstrate the art of burlesque um, gracefully and bring out this beautiful art form in its original style to some of its original music. Um, well, our artistic director of the group, Gerald French, definitely is, well, the body too, but definitely is the soul of um, of this group. He is born and raised in New Orleans and comes from a very um, prestigious musical family, the French family, whose father, George French, is also performing in Ascona. They have so much soul. He has so much soul just in his pinky toe, like, it's, it's ridiculous. But the idea um, of body and soul is you have these beautiful women, the, the burlesque dancers, with these phenomenal bodies and you have the soul of New Orleans bringing traditional jazz and blues and it's a good combination, we'll leave it at that. <laughs> the Creole Sinker Painters is comprised of five musicians, um, again Gerald French on drums and Kerry Lewis on bass, Tom Fisher on clarinet and saxophone and Steve Pistorius on piano. These are some of the top musicians in the world. Um, and then myself on vocals. Uh, we specialize in traditional New Orleans jazz and play songs ranging from uh, Bourbon Street Parade to oh, She's a Great Great Girl, which is not specifically New Orleans jazz, but it embodies the era of burlesque. We also do a couple Urban Berlin tunes and uh, Donald Ellison, I believe is his name. Um, but it's just it's a fun, upbeat music that we perform for specifically the burlesque show. The show wouldn't be the show without the Creole Syncopators, nor would it be a show without the dancers. Um, that's the beauty of the show, is that we've combined the two, the band plus the dancers, specifically for the performance. Um, a lot of burlesque dancers dance to what they call canned music, which is recorded music, which is fine. But with a live band, especially with Gerald on drums, he tends to play with the drums while the girls are dancing. So, you know, if a little something comes off, there's a cymbal hit. If there is a lot of shaking, <laughs> you hear a lot of brrrr. Um, so it's really fun to play with the girls musically as well. And they're able to perform with us in harmony versus having a choreographed dance to uh, recorded music. So the show is one whole piece versus one joining the other. Oh, <laughs> so many where to start. Um, I definitely plan on continuing this project with the Creole Sweet Teas show and um, bringing it to new levels, new performances, new themes, bringing it worldwide. We have, again, a high caliber of musicians, high caliber of dancers, and want to bring this out to the world. So I definitely plan on, on working with this group for quite some time and elongating the project. Um, Personally, just continue to do what I love and go from there. Paradise again. I can't. I can't get over it. I wake up in the my my daily routine so far. I wake up in the morning, grab my cafe latte or latte macchiato. 
Am I saying that right? Okay, good. <laughs> um, and then my little um, Romaggio with Panna <laughs> and on on lake in the middle of the Alps. And then walk around the boardwalk, do a little shopping, check my email, go swimming. I don't know, surrounded by jazz of every genre. You have world jazz, you have Dixieland, you have um, modern, you have New Orleans, you have gospel. And that goes on till performance at night. And then after the performance, go to the musician's jam and hang out and meet other musicians and listen to some great jamming. And then go to bed and do it all over again. And that, that is la vie en rose. <laughs> That's, that is the life of roses right there. It's beautiful. I don't want to leave, but I will. Just so I can come back next year and bring it again. Yeah. We really appreciate y'all um, bringing us here and, and the hospitality you've shown us. You guys have been amazing with the excitement and, and the anticipation and, again, the hospitality. Everybody has been so friendly. And very excited specifically um, for the burlesque show because we've never had burlesque at Escona before. So that's gone over very well. Um, people have been very great about um, receiving this performance. And again, we hope to bring it again next year.